my recent live streams, someone asked me, how do I stay so disciplined? And I think once you start getting into like old man status like I am, you're a lot more grateful. And that's something that I definitely had to learn throughout, I won't say recently, but just throughout the years, because there was a point where I definitely was not grateful for what I had. It was always about what I don't have. What do I want? You know, I'm not there yet. Why isn't it working? As opposed to, you know, having the, the goal, but also realizing hey, what progress have you made? And, you know, stacking your small wins, like I say, usually. So once I started to just be more grateful and just take a moment to, like, to reflect and just to see, okay, well, this time a few years ago, you were begging to be in this particular position. Now it's just a matter of, okay, incrementally, let's get to the next level and so forth, instead of just taking this one major leap to get there. So I think once that starts to happen, that just reinforces me just staying on the path, staying disciplined. So it kind of goes hand in hand a little bit when you think about it, because the more grateful that you are, you take a moment to just see, hey, look at the progress I did make. It makes, it gives you like a mind shift because then you're, you would think to yourself, okay, well, if I locked in for six months and I made it here, what could I do in another six months? And what's a year going to look like? And so you see now you start creating a new habit that you associate embracing where you are, but then push it on to the next level. Embracing where you are. Look how, you, you know, where you've come. And then keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Instead of just, I don't have this. I can't have that. So something to think about, you know, every time I make a video, I'm going to scream discipline in every way because that is the foundation. But more content, more videos on the way. Let's go.